Hi guys, James from DVG here, <clears throat> and welcome to another video. This video is basically a massive, massive shout out to Warlord Games. Um, I should have made this video uh, months ago because uh, I made a, I made an order to Warlord Games in January, and because I just had a number of sales, <coughs> a number of offers, and everything, um, they were very, 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 very stretched. And I knew it would take quite a while for my order to come through. I wasn't bothered. It was for stuff that I wouldn't be able to paint or even use for weeks or even months. So it didn't bother me in the slightest. Not in the slightest. Um, but it got to about a month and a half and I hadn't actually heard anything. So I thought, okay, I'll drop them a quick email. And their customer service team is amazing. Um, the reason it took so long was because they were out of stock of a number of items and they were so pushed with all the other, all the other orders. I'll have no time to manufacture anymore. And so I said, don't worry, they, they let me know which ones um, they can fulfill. Refunded me for the price of those and sent me uh, the balance of the order, which is very cool. Um, as it turned out, one of the things I ordered, I already, ha already had. So it's a good thing that it wasn't available because otherwise I would have two of them and I wouldn't be able to use them. As it turns out, that army, I am now um, well, by the time this video is out, that army will probably be on eBay um, because I've just decided I have seven unpainted bolt action armies. Seven. That's going to take me, I, because of all my commission work, it's going to take me so long to get around to paint them all. I thought I'll get rid of a couple. So I'm, I'm now down to five. So I've got two British, one Italian, and two German. Uh, the Italian paratrooper army and the Soviet um, late war army are now on eBay. So if you're interested in those things, that they're not painted, they are assembled. Um, the Soviet one is around a thousand points, and the Italian one is around 800 points. Um, but if you're interested, if I can work out how to do it, I'll pop a link in the description. If not, they'll be on the Facebook page. So check them out. If you're interested, ooh, kick the thing in. Oh, if you can hear that in the background, that is my son is playing Fortnite and he gets really agitated about it. Anyway, um, so this is, I'm just going to show you what I ordered and explain what it's all for. And then I'm going to show you the letter that I received with the order, um, which is very cool of them. They don't, have, they don't have to do this, but it's very cool of them. Um, so you've been stand, sitting at this and looking at this half open box for almost three minutes. So let's see what's inside. Um, there's packing. Um, that's the invoice, you don't need to see that. Um, so let's see what's in here. Uh, we have an SDK Z250 stroke 9 new recce. We have a German here MG42 team 1943 to 45. We have a here Pioneer. Panzerschreck and Flamethrower teams. We have an Italian infantry section, which is going to go to my other Italian army, and a BEF section, which is going to round off the BEF to a nice thousand points. So that's what I have. Um, I won't take this out of the packet, um, but you'll see it built and painted. Um, this is for uh, my Fall of the Reich armies. I've got two, I've got an SS one, uh, which is um, dug out an old Panzer IV G, um, but it's still got all the um, Panzer Faust and MG 42s and all that. And then these two are for um, for the Reich armies. Um, uh, that's basically the army is probably about 50% inexperienced. The rest is regular. Um, so these are just for my MG 42 team. I don't think a German army shouldn't be without. Um, a medium machine gun and obviously Panzer Shrek and Flamethrowers. Flamethrowers are devastating um, in the game and Panzer Shreks uh, can be unreliable but they are really cool and I think part of late war German uh, German army should have one. So here's the letter. Um, I'm not going to read it to you. The long and short of it is um, they're apologizing for the delay in my order um, telling me all, all the stuff I need to do if anything goes wrong, there's phone numbers and email addresses. But right at the end, 
um, they've given me a offer code for February and March for a 15% off the order during the month of uh, February and March, just as an, um, a thank you for being a customer and a bit of an apology for um, for the delay on my order, um, which I think is massively cool. I don't know many companies that will do that. I know Games Workshop go out of their way to get their customers what they want. If they haven't got it in stock, they do tend to refund. Um, but I don't think Games Workshop would give you a discount code. Um, February was quite an expensive month for me. Uh, March is also quite an expensive month for me, so I'm just going to readjust so you can... <coughs> Yeah, because um, it's Mother's Day and my mother's birthday. Um, also, Shadow Spear um, is out, and I may have bought that. So I might not have any ready funds uh, to put into um, a new. Come on, James. Words, words. Um, a new bolt action army. Um, I said I already sold two, um, but I do have three access and two allied now. So I need a third allied one just to level it off so um, I've got an idea about that um, so if my eBay goes well and by the end of the month um, all should be good and I'll put my order in and then there'll be another video on that if I don't get a chance to do it it's not too much of a problem um, this video is just about how it seems that Warlord Games customer uh, means so much to them, they do these things for them. Even if there's the situations are out of their control, um, well, other companies go, tough, have your money back. These guys go, they've sent, us, sent me the stuff they can, they've refunded me the stuff they couldn't, and they also sent me a code for a 15% discount, which I don't have to do. So I think that's really cool. Anyway. As I normally say, do all the YouTube stuff, like and subscribe, and check out our affiliates, games, um, Goblin Gaming and White Shot Gaming, links in the description, um, and maybe I'll put in the um, links to the eBay stuff as well, if I can work out how to do it. And as usual, thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you next time.